This is a story about an ordinary teddy bear. When he was made, they found something wrong with him and threw him away like a piece of rubbish into an old dark storeroom. Then, from outer space, a spotty man brought him to life with his cosmic dust. He took him to a magic cloud where Mother Nature gave him special powers. That bear became Super Ted. A cool breeze blows through the mountains of Wales, ruffling the heather and spinning mist into snake-like strands. Hanging in the wind is one of the rarest birds in the world, the giant red kite. As it floats down over the mountain, the bird senses something. Its nest is in danger. In the valley below, three figures are walking by the lake. It's a lovely spot, isn't it? Well, I've seen lovelier spots on spot. Lots of rare birds come here to nest. You see that tiny dot in the sky? That's a giant red kite. Looks like a bird to me. It is a bird, Spotty. Its eggs are so rare that egg collectors will do anything to get them. It's my job to make sure nobody steals them. Help! Shoo! Oh, go away! Oh! Just shut up and grab the eggs, bonehead. Hold oh, still, will you, or I'll let go. Let go. Anything you say, Ted. <laughs> oh, it's a rock. Chips, there'll be no more giant red kites. Oh, oh dear. Mr. Super Ted, where are you? Blistering bananas, spotty. Where did that come from? Well, it wasn't a meteorite. It, it's the wrong time of year. It came from up on the mountain. But well, something must have shifted that rock. Or someone. I think we should take a look. But it's getting dark. Let's leave it till tomorrow. But later that night. It's cold, cold wind. Yuck. I hate the cold and the dark. I like the dark. I look really handsome in the dark. Tex says the darker it gets, the better I look. Where is Tex? Why isn't he here? Tex wouldn't be any good for this. Stealing eggs is a job for delicate hands like mine. Look! The nest! Uh, don't they look lovely? No, they don't. Oh. Those horrible sharp beaks make my bones shake. <laughs> no, no, no bulk. <laughs> bulk. Just grab the eggs. No, no, bulk. No, no, no. No! Oh! oh. 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 Put those claws away. Oh! Ah! Thanks for chasing off those birds, fellas. <laughs> <laughs> These eggs look great in a glass case. Meanwhile, in Gwen's cottage on the mountainside... I'm glad we didn't go out on the mountain. It, it looks so cold and dark tonight. Put your feet up, Spotty, and tell us about the planet Spot. What kind of birds do you have there? Uh, well, uh, on Spot, the, the birds don't have feathers. Uh, they have a, a lot of trouble flying straight. You could be sitting around a fire like this, and then all of a sudden... Someone has stolen its eggs. If we don't get them back soon, They'll never hatch. Oh, it looks like we'll have to go into the cold, dark night after all. I'd better say my magic word. Yes, and, and, and I'll put on my rocket pack. I suppose I'll have to walk. No, climb on the back of the bird. Well, come on, let's go. And our heroes fly up into the dark sky. High on the mountaintop, they find the nest empty. <laughs> that sure had him fooled. He, watch this. The bicycle. Oh, sure feels good to be back in the saddle. Get here, you weak critter. Let's get on out of here. On the path in front of Tex. Oh, no. The muddy mud 
monsters of the deep. Moan! Moan! Moan. Uh, guess who, Tex? Good joke, isn't it, Tex? Get out of my way, imbeciles. On the mountainside above them. There's no sign of anyone. Oh, dear. But we're never going to save those eggs. Don't worry, Spotty. We will get them back somehow. Look! Look! Down there! Yeah, a, a light! Galloping gooseberries, you're right. Come on, Spotty. We've got no time to lose. I'll take care of the zigs, boys. You just keep running alongside. I don't seem to be able to run as fast as you, Tex. Maybe that's because I'm riding a bike. Oh, that's as far as I'm going. Oh, I can't go another step further. My bones simply won't take it. Oh, no. This is one problem I think I can tackle. Uh, what's that? Oh, no, Bulk, you idiot. <laughs> Not fair, no one ever lets me win. <laughs> now, where did Tex go? Try looking up here, Featherbrain. Why, I'll... Don't try anything, Super Ted, or I'll smash this egg. Guess I've been a bit too clever for you, huh? <laughs> How'd you like your eggs, Featherbrain? Poached or scrambled? Save from back in their nest, thank you. I'll blast you out of the sky. No, you don't. Take that. Hello, Tex. And so much later. Goodbye, Gwen. Uh, goodbye. Goodbye. And thank you for saving those eggs. Oh, dear. What's up, Spotty? I never did finish that story about the bald birds of a spot. 